one rib, pour out the Jameson for ancestors to swig. You rescue me yet again. You put me first everywhere. You make me feel better than the mother too. You rescue me yet again. You put me first everywhere. Thank you for tuning to the Black Fathers Initiative of Cleveland. Really appreciate the love. Make sure you guys click the link in the bio. Like, subscribe. You know what to do. And, of course, you know what we do here. Black love, black relationships, black community, black money, black solutions, all black everything pretty much. So, today, <clears throat> I'm doing something different. Um, I appreciate all my subscribers. And I definitely look at my comments as well as uh, my analytics and stuff. And I see that, you know. Most of my followers are men who, you know, enjoy the information that, you know, I'm sharing, things of that nature. Do have some women, but not as many uh, brothers, you know, not as many as the brothers. So I appreciate that. So what I'm going to do is let me give you guys something different today. Um, I had, in sh I, well, I had a show called The Smart Alex Podcast. Um, it's about three years ago. We probably got up to about two. We got up to a lot of episodes, but um, you know things didn't work out. And honestly, we're trying to get things back together. So, what I would like to do is I would like for you guys to watch this and um, leave a comment. Let me know if you liked it or if you didn't like it. Let me know if it's something that you would like to see more often. If you would like, you know, uh, Handsome John, Queen Marie, um, Taylor Jones, she's on her own thing, but she, uh, she has retired from the porn industry. So, but you can still, I think you can still look her up if you want to, but I, I mean, I believe she's retired. She hasn't done any new scenes or anything of that nature, but Handsome John, T. Marie, those were two of my, um, well, two of my friends that, you know, we do podcasts and stuff like that. So we were thinking about bringing this podcast back and pretty much the, um, the format of it was pretty much a interview type podcast where we bring in um, individuals who have um, businesses or just interesting uh, black individuals who have businesses and have done things in the black community and interview them and um, and talk about, you know, sometimes we talk about uh, current events, things going on in the black community, stuff like that. In this episode, we just were pretty much asking her about the porn industry because, you know, nobody, you know, this is our first time meeting a a porn, uh, somebody who actually did porno movies with, you know, real porno people. So it was a, uh, it was enlightening. So definitely check it out. Appreciate the love, guys. Make sure you guys click the link in the bio, like, subscribe. Once again, comment. Let me know if you guys uh, like the interview. And like I stated, um, we may be, you know, bringing this show back. Um, if you want to follow us at our, um, I believe the page is Acquired Taste Media LLC. So if you want to follow this page and see some of the old episodes, you can go there to Acquire Taste Media um, YouTube page, and we have all the episodes still up there. All right? Appreciate the love. Peace. Welcome to this edition of The Smart Alex. You know who I am. I'm John, the host of The Smart Alex, the smartest of all The Smart Alex. Um, I feel like the luckiest man in the world on this episode. I'm surrounded by all these lovely ladies. On my left side, I got It's a lot. More than I'm used okay. to. Oh, well, okay. It's more beauty than I'm used to. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you like that? <laughs> so, I got my, I got the queen of the smart apps. Yes. Miss yes. Marie, how you doing today? I'm good today. How are you? I'm all right. I'm all right. We got a great guest. We have the lovely star of stage and screen, the vivacious, curvous, Beautiful Taylor John, how you doing? Think a bit of sniffles. Woo woo! Thanks for coming on today. No problem. No problem. Welcome to the Smart Alex. You I'm, feel? I'm gonna try to talk up because I'm, I'm very soft spoken, so I'm gonna talk up. Okay. Yeah, I'm talk up. Okay. <laughs> well, you gonna talk up today for like five, six minutes? It's okay. <laughs> Welcome to. The, you feel smarter for being on the Smart Alex already? I'm sure you do. I'm sure you do. Most people do. Most people do. We are gonna get into some stuff. We are gonna talk about you. So let's talk about, let's jump in it right quick. You got a clothing line, right? Yes. What's I it do. called? Um, it's Pure Envy by uh, TJ. Um, right now I'm in the process of revamping it because I released it um, early last year. Mm -hmm. um, it was online. Kind of got busy with some things. Uh, got sidetracked. Um, okay. But I just wanted to go a different direction, so I'm trying to focus on, like, 
what I really like. Um, so right now I'm focused on lingerie, lingerie, um, mm. swimwear, like you know, dresses, things like that. Like shit, I like to see myself in. Okay. So, Okay, that's dope. That's you think dope. I lay in around the house or nothing? Okay, okay. okay. So you making sexy lingerie? <laughs> Show it off. Right, you could, right, could have had yeah. some sexy lingerie on the show. <laughs> we wouldn't have minded. We would not have minded <laughs> at all. Sure. I'm sure. I'm sure, sure. I, I would have been okay with it. I'm just saying that's just how my side looks at it. Right, right. So you in school. What you in school for? Um, business management. Um, my concentration in healthcare. I graduate actually this year. Oh, in August. Oh, okay. congratulations. Nice. Thank you. I have my bachelor's. It's been a long time coming. Oh, but, right. yeah. Hey, it's kind of hard job. when you got a kid to graduate. Okay. <laughs> Just okay. one kid? Just one, but, um. So, like, 20, right? <laughs> she She's 12, so she. Oh, uh, sure. Yeah. She's grown. No. Yeah, that's she's up there. <laughs> I feel you. Oh, my goodness. No, that working and school is a lot. Can't do full time student working and taking care of the kids. So right, right, definitely. Ah, you know what I want to get to, Tasha? The fucking. Hi, with lingerie. I mean, because you know, I heard the name Taylor Jones, so I get to searching. This is this is what the people know you as. You are gonna keep it real, right? This is this what brought you to the forefront? Just just kind of being. And was it porn initially, or no. how did you I get into a, it? I was a dancer. Dancer. Dancer, dancer here? Mm -hmm. Okay, which you put? I started working at um, Tops and Bottoms downtown. Okay. Mm. Um, nice establishment. I remember from that. From there, I got seen um, by Pinky. And yeah. the manager yeah. Okay. Me there. And for like a year, they were like, come do a scene, come do a scene. I was like, oh, hell no. I ain't, you know, yeah, whatever. No, thank you. I'm just going you know, start doing it my own way. Okay. Um, Is that something that you were trying to get into? Or? No. Okay. I never was anything I thought I'd do. Okay. Um, I never even watched it, to be honest. Really? Uh, just, Are like, you serious? So you, so you wouldn't even consider yourself like a freaky I've type never person? Watched my or? Scenes. I've never seen myself. I have not seen them personally. Are you like, serious? Like, I've I posted, like, the promos. Yeah. But I have not sit, sat and watched the whole thing. Like, no, why is that? Like, no. So, I, Why? I don't know. It's just what? Like, I, I, would, I, would, I don't know. It's, I'm not weird. Person. it's weird, but I just, I, I, I can't. I don't know. Like, really? I can watch me and, like, my significant other, yeah. Okay. But I can't sit and watch that because it's not, it's not real to me. It's not. I'm literally there, like, faking, like, the whole thing. So, <laughs> what do I want to watch that for? Wow. So, you know. so it's nothing? So it's like really? acting? Yeah. Oh, my God. That was not, it's not what everybody thinks it is. It's like. First off, my 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 last scene, I did three. My last one was, it was like another scene being shot upstairs in this big ass um, house, then another scene being shot in the pool like with some other people. So you're not just it's being it's just you and one person. It's a lot of people like coming and going. going. Somebody telling you stop, wait like this, like that, hold up. I need you lock like it's the whole wow. way through. It's not just the so. Act. Then how do you get worn back up if they keep stopping you like that? That, that is it's just weird. It's just a whole situation. It's, it's so how like, long would it say you last? Like to, to shoot an actual fact? Like, like you're on set like all day. Like all for one day. For like a five minute day. video, 17 minutes. I mean, minutes. they're not five minutes. For they're like, like 30 minutes. Yeah. They're like, they're like, <laughs> like you don't watch it. I, I do watch right. it, but I watch the free stuff, which is five minutes. Right. Those are big Don't play me now. Those are big I'm just saying. <laughs> you hear big the vignettes, right? They're yeah, vignettes. Sound in that here, right? Oh, okay. It makes okay. it sound classier. Gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> that is crazy. So it's all day. Day. It, For one, all all day. Day. I mean, cause you gotta think like you're in hair and makeup. Okay. For a couple hours, gotta go to location. You're in location. They gotta figure out the storyline. Then <laughs> storyline, they gotta do pictures. And then you pictures, then you get the scene done. But within that scene, it's. So much transition though. Okay, we need you on the couch like this. We need you on a chair like this. Put a leg like this. Like it's it's, it's so not, much. To, it's, it's not, not just free flowing. Act, no. It's not free flowing no, like it's it not appears. At all. 
So this is this is this answers my next question because I'll be remiss. I know my sons were asking. They were very upset with one video in particular. They said they were upset that you were not taking the dick with. Oh, Rico, because first Rico. Of all, oh, so you know the dick. Okay. Everybody, because it's my very first one, Rico. Okay. And I'm be honest. Me, I knew Rico before I even did the porn. We never slept together, but okay. we were cool. We met in Vegas, friends. He told me he was a stripper, not a porn, not a porn. So we were cool, just friends. Okay. Um, we had fell out months before we did that scene, so I didn't even want to be in the scene with him. At Got all. you. Like so I, you like, eh. I had cussed him out literally like the month before because he lied, which is crazy. It's, it's so petty, okay. but <laughs> he had lied to my manager saying he fucked me. Before the scene had even happened, and then lo and behold, I had to end up doing the scene with wow. him. So I was just super irritated. And you don't have a choice in that. Like, no, it, my choice was a white guy my first time. Okay. But the, he was so high, like, and he wanted to not use protection. I wasn't okay. with him. Okay. So, I know that's wrong. Um, so that's Wrap why. Wrap it up. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yeah, so that's why they end up calling Rico because I refused to, you know, do that route with that guy. Gotcha. So, okay. Get out of here. But, and plus, and I have walls. I'm sorry. I'm not going to let just anybody just pound and go hard on me. Sorry. Not about to do it. So, Rico, <laughs> cut it out. Cut, <laughs> cut it out. And then, what's the name you should yes, do on Yes, you just Dave Coulier <laughs> in reference to porn. Yes. So, that was like a full house reference. What? So, <laughs> thanks. That was awesome. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but you did a full house reference in what? porn. That was awful. awesome. <laughs> Awesome. So, alright. I know dudes shoot at you all day. Right. Mm -hmm. What's what's some of the shit that you hate? When they, what they do? Um, my number one pet peeve I would say is like dudes be like, Oh, you don't date regular niggas or it's just something where I feel like you're a fan. Like don't okay. approach me like you're a fan. Okay. Um, that is just the number one thing I can I cannot tolerate. Um So don't take a selfie with you and then ask you for your number. Yeah, the, I mean, it's not even that, because most dudes will jump in my DM and be like, oh my God, I love you so much. It's just the extraness. Right, me. right, like, It's not right. genuine. Okay. Like, gotcha. approach me, gen I'm, and I, I met my ex on Instagram. So it's probably real for four years. So it's possible to okay. meet someone and be with somebody. Right. But he wasn't a fan. He, he just came with you. Right. Exactly. Okay. Um, don't send me no dick pics. Oh, so dick pics are no. thumbs down? No one wants any. I don't. What the hell? I, I don't. I don't. I, I'm sorry. What woman just thinks? Yeah. I don't care. Really? I don't care. I'm supposed to be like. What, what about soliciting? Like, nice like, like, okay, so unsolicited. Like, so that looks tasty. There you go, Tosh. <laughs> You're thinking exactly what he's thinking right there when he says it. Like she's gonna be like, I like this. Oh no. I'm giving not, this a call. We're like, okay. No, because even when my dude sends me one now, I'd be like. Okay. Okay. Right. I mean, I've seen like, it. What I do you want me to do? Like, I don't understand. I'll get you that at home. All right. I got right, you. Exactly. Man. I got you. I got your SOS. So there's no. So there's so unsolicited dick pics. You know, right. ladies don't like. If I want, if I ask you to send it because I feel it freaky and I want you to pose in a certain way, perhaps. Yeah, because it just you would. Um, if I was to open up my Snapchat right now, like I don't. Please don't. I, I'm not. <laughs> I'm just saying. Originally, stole all my little content and stuff, so I had to redo. A lot of stuff, so I had to put the by TJ on it when I had redone it. When I had, I said, when I got it. How smart am I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but, um, it's okay. Yeah. It's okay to make mistakes with <laughs> the smart Alex. Nobody John make, makes you, them all the time. Like, you when, should probably be the smartest. So don't. But when you mess up, nobody says anything. We it's just fine, forgive you. It's, fine, it's, fine. <laughs> but, it's okay. Uh, yeah, I just had to redo it, and um, you know, when people found out it was my shit. You know, people don't want to support you because. Why? Right, and we was going to address <laughs> and that's the thing, yeah. and, that's, and that's one of the things we was going to address. Why do you think you got so many haters? Is it your booty? Is it your brains? To, to be honest, like, and I'm just be 100, I okay. don't, I don't, I don't know why. Because, like, when people get to know me, like, I'm real chill, I'm humble, like, I'm down to earth, like, I'm the complete opposite of people see. Like, people be like, oh, I seen you, and I thought you were stuck up, you were this, you were wow. that. Like, my mother does say I, I come off as bougie. I will say I do. Okay. I, I can admit that. Okay. But, it, but it's how I was brought up. Like, all through high school, my mother made me and my sister wear heels every day. Mm. Like, 
we were taught to be a lady and, and be a certain kind of way and hold yourself to. You have to wear heels in high school yeah. every day. And no, skirts. I was not playing. Oh yeah. I couldn't even walk to the corner store and not be dressed. Like I wow. had to be dressed. My mother was on us. <laughs> I mean that's dope, lightweight, but I might have rolled you some days for wearing heels every day. Just saying. I mean I was an athlete, so it's not every day. Like. Oh, oh no. I mean, right, what I ran track. I had a full scholarship to college. Oh, yeah. um, What'd you run? Right. The four and the two. Okay. I, I used to want to go to the Olympics I had, before I had a kid. Yeah, <laughs> going to the Olympics? Yes, that was my dream. Y'all can wow. me out too. <laughs> Just Google, I don't even tell my real name, but <laughs> I can tell you I have to raise my real name. You can't. <laughs>
subscribe to Redline Radio, Saturdays noon to 2. You can hear the Smart Alex. It's all for Smart Alex. Me being the smartest, of course, as you see. That's how God puts the shit. I'm like, you you remember on the Five Heart Beats when it was like, yeah, I write all the songs and shit. That's how I am. That's kind of. That's how I feel. Could you spell out the word Redline? Well, how is it supposed to be? Because that was the problem. No, As red a, line was together, correct? Right, right. It's all one word. Red line, space, radio, space, LLC. No, right. you have to be clear because I have put it in. People have put it in the wrong way. Well, that's all. Well, how does make sure you tell me How come I was able to find it? And you can call us. You can talk to the lovely Tasha. Yes. Al, yes. Angry Al will be there. The young professor will be there. It's a fun time. They will be there, too. Oh, yeah. Produce. Oh, yeah. Dave on the board. Yeah, Dave on the board. This is Guy now. It's our guy. It's our guy. So we want to thank you, Miss Jones, for stopping thank you by. Thank for having me. Uh, well, it was amazing for you stopping by, um, Tasha. You did a great interview, of course. Thank you. So much better than Rodney at the <laughs> And I thank you for showing up. Fuck you. Awesome. He's everybody's guy, but he's he's like you're just better than him. Like you're better. And that's why we love you. Okay. I'll accept it. If I have to. Right. You, you don't. You do. Sorry. So, we want you guys to tune in next week to another great edition of the Smart Alex. Remember, oh, where can they hit you on Instagram, my dear? And where can they talk about your clothes and shit and hate on you? Because that's what they do on the right. internet, apparently. <laughs> and send you dick pics. <laughs> so, let them know where they can send their dick pics and hate on you. No dick pics, but, <laughs> yeah. but feel free to, to uh, send anything else. I accept all forms of payment. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't right. pay in dick pics. <laughs> like I'll send you one every morning. Just gonna um, cash that in. On Instagram, uh, Snapchat, Twitter, uh, Facebook, all Taylor Jones, XOXO, all one word. Um, yeah. Oh, um, sorry, my code of life is also Instagram at pure. At pure MB underscore by Taylor. Is that right? Is it? She is it? Is it? We're going to let her check. While she's checking that, where can they get you at, Queen? Out the new page, Queen Marie underscore CLE. New page. She's our queen. She's our smart alley queen. queen. <laughs>